This is the CMC Markets Connect volatility report. It was a distinctly mixed bag for the Aussie dollar dollar trade on Wednesday as the market attempted to digest both the softer than expected Australian inflation print, followed by a clear signal from the Federal Reserve the inflation fight wasn't over yet. It was this second point that served to dominate, driving broad-based weakness for the greenback, as some are left believing that the extended run of higher rates will start to erode growth. One day vol on AUD USD sat at 14.16% against 10.81% for the month. That Australian inflation data bolstered the performance of the ASX 200, which has been making steady gains over the last three weeks. The support here was sufficient to leave the index as the most active in the cohort, with one day vol sitting at 17.56% against 11.07% on the month. The Nasdaq was also left looking somewhat skittish, although levels held despite the hawkish Fed narrative. One day vol sat at 19.5% against 14.2% for the month. Price action elsewhere was focused on a number of heavyweight individual stocks. UK banks were rattled in the wake of government intervention, seeing the head of NatWest resign, but it was Pierre Lloyd's banking group that proved to be the most active after earnings news was seen to disappoint. One day vol here printed 76.04% against 30.59% on the month. Conversely, Boeing found favour off its numbers, where a narrower loss and higher sales than had been forecast impressed the market. The underlying added close on 9%, with one day vol printing 79.32% against 36.06% for the month.